what are we all so afraid of? We're afraid of our perceptions. We're afraid of the idea that we've been dropped and we have to go, go it alone. We're afraid that this is all there is, that what we can perceive with our five senses is, is it, and that this whole idea of coming to life and being a human being is, is a bad, mean joke. Because of that, we are afraid of whatever we believe is the, the entity in charge of this. Some people call that God. Some people call that, you know, random nature. We're afraid of what we don't embrace. So the whole way home and out of fear is to shatter this perception that we have with embrace so much embrace that we love it all so much we don't even have to know why we love it but in the loving of it we add the essence of truth to it so that all of the parts of it that are untenable and impossible to embrace begin to be transcended in our embrace. But we have to do that individually. We can't wait for someone else to come along and fix and change it. We have to allow for our own perceptions to shift. And in that, we own a different identity. We own our immortal self. We own the self that can't be touched or harmed in any way that doesn't identify with just being a physical body or a finite mind, an intellect. It's the vastness of us that no matter what will be here. And so literally, we're afraid of our finite minds and our capacity to trick ourselves into believing that this is all there is and to be afraid of whatever we don't see, the unseen that is beyond it, enough to never touch it, enough to know it and its vastness and perfection. So we all need to just come home and be more loving to ourselves, be more kind to ourselves. And what are we also afraid of? Sometimes we're afraid of spending this quality time loving ourselves so impeccably that we shatter the illusions that we have and we realize that only love is real. It's time for us to give up everything else but a very one-pointed intention and perception that only love is real. So if it appears to be unloving, we look, do a deep dive, do a deep dive. Where's the love here? Where's the love? And we'll find it. We'll find what's missing. And then we won't be so scared.